Hi, I'm Timothy Jordan for The Developer Show, and this is your weekly update on developer news from Google. It turns out that 54% of users who left a one-star review in the Play Store mention app stability and bugs. To help you understand how to build high-quality Android apps and scale your business, we're hosting an Android App Excellence Summit on April 12th. CodeJam is Google's longest running coding competition and has returned for its 19th season. Participants work their way through multiple rounds of algorithmic coding challenges for a chance to advance to the world finals, be crowned the CodeJam world champion, and win the grand prize. The qualification round is on April 1st. You'll have 27 hours to submit a solution and earn enough points to advance to round one. But don't worry, it only takes a few hours to complete. Go to g.co slash codejam to sign up. Community security analytics are here. They are a set of open sourced queries and rules designed for self-service security analytics to help detect common cloud-based threats. We believe that fostering a community around standardizing and sharing cloud security analytics across our portfolio of offerings can help improve detective capabilities. Now, your security operations teams can use CSA to get started with analyzing your Google Cloud logs to audit recent behavior and help detect threats to your workloads. Head on over to the post for more. ReCAPTCHA Enterprise is Google's online fraud detection service that can be used to prevent fraud and attacks by scripts, bot software, or humans. And now Account Defender is in public preview. It's a new feature built into ReCAPTCHA Enterprise that helps you determine if an action aligns or deviates from the account, the account owner's typical behavior. Links to get started are on the post. In Angular 13.2.0, we released Extended Diagnostics. It's a new feature in the Angular compiler, which gives more insight into your templates and how you might be able to improve them. These diagnostics give compiled time warnings with precise, actionable suggestions for your templates, catching bugs before you notice them. Everything you need to get started, including examples, are on the post. To learn more about all of this week's stories, make sure to check out the description box below for all the links. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, and stay safe. I'm Timothy Jordan for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.